I am Caitlin Wheeler, and I am the director of A Player to Be Named Later. So I came across this last spring uh, in May of 2012. It was written by a colleague of mine and she had written, it's a short story that she wrote for an English class and it really just impacted me and how this story just needed to be told for everyone who had had a miscarriage in their life and were struggling with, you know, the grief of it and the process of getting over the loss of a, of a baby and so I really wanted to take this story and make it into something that a lot of people could watch and realize that this is a serious thing and that it's hard to get over something like this. So I, I, point, I wanted to tell this story for that purpose. Do you know your line? Wait, Do you know your line? I couldn't it's gonna be okay. wait to give my bear. Everything's gonna, everything's be okay. gonna be okay. I'm here I'm now. now. Yeah. Okay. She's crying. Seems a little so pretentious of you. <laughs> Hurry up. When do I say right? your line? Okay. You don't. It's gonna cut before you do any lines. Okay. Okay. Action. Action. We went upon choosing talent by who we thought mainly the couple, uh, the younger couple that had the miscarriage, we wanted to place them into a role of, you know, they have this demeanor of, you know, a cute couple at the same time as being a realis realistic um, couple who has gotten pregnant and could have a miscarriage and we wanted to make it a realistic role as well as them be able to fit that role well and play that role well and to be able to show the emotion of the dynamic of the film and they did a fantastic job I mean I was a little apprehensive about taking the leadership role in this part I was I'm glad they did it because I couldn't I wouldn't have been able to adapt it from prose it looks like I'm gonna pull my eyes out yes I'm really excited to see how this turns out I don't know how to explain it. I mean, I'm maybe, maybe I'll be able to explain it better when I see it, but um, it's kind of interesting considering the other projects I've worked on where we're telling a story about normal people, which I think we should do more of, and now we are. Yeah, sure. Okay, you wear fires. And we burn down the house. Dramatic ending. And the dramatic ending is the lighting crew knocks over the line. And the house burns down and they all... Roll Phil, roll Phil. How did that one get over there? Michael, you just get to stay behind there. I have to see that. It's been a lot of fun. It's been really fun working with all the kids. And then it's been really cool to watch all the behind the scenes stuff. How the lighting works and that sort of thing. I've liked it. It's been fun. Great way to spend the day. I think I can get it well, in one shot. What is that called? The line. Just get it close enough for a fit. 180. Just 180. Yeah, the one you need to the other side. Okay. Well, isn't there something you can do to, like, you, you can you have cross to reset the line. Your shot. Yeah, you can cross the line, the 180 line, and then you're fine. Oh. Um, but you'll be fine. Don't worry. We'll be fine. Don't worry. <laughs> Separate conversation. I'm a little out of it right now. Okay. <laughs> Go. <laughs> 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 
so okay. Thank you. Okay. There's still one more level. Oh, God, no, yes, I was in a feature oh, film for okay. not a short video. <laughs> I was, actually. Yes, he was in a feature film. That was the kids are great. Go, they seem to know what they're doing. Like the, if you look at they're the professional. I like it. The fireplace, that's <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm rolling. I'm rolling. Rolling. We'll do whatever kind of donut. I think what we'll do is just we'll have the parents open the door and the chat room. Oh, there is Make you do something with them. And show the Are you editing the sound set? What? I'm you editing the sound. No, I just turn it in the SD card at the end. Like trying to put on the mind cut to inside as they're coming in. If you think that works. The crew that we chose is great. Um, every, the director of photography is fantastic at what he's doing. He went to the site early and planned out all his shooting and the assistant DP is great to work with. Everyone has a great time on set. Even, even the dynamic of the story is, is troubling and is the, the cast know, or the crew and cast knows this and they take it to heart and they take it seriously but then on set it's also a joy and working with everybody and it was a great, a great time and a great experience for everybody. Oh, oh yeah. It's, it's, oh. it's unbelievable. Oh, yeah. Like, probably third degree burn. I'll do it. Set your hand on fire hot. Yeah. 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 Yep. Our audience that we want to aim most of this at is anyone who has had a miscarriage or has history of having a miscarriage or knows someone who has a miscarriage. It can anyone can watch this, but we really wanted to trigger that audience of, you know, we we relate with this topic, we relate with this film in an emotional sense to so that they can engage and learn that you know it's going to be okay and that they can and will get through this process. Great, they didn't yell at me once and um, they're very experienced and very nice and you can tell that they've had great leadership. Oh, that okay, fine. I think we're good. Okay. Cool. Actually, Nikki, you might need to move back. <laughs> Okay, and action. Wait, no. Oh, no, no, not action. <laughs> My bad. Okay. Make up a Ready and rolling. Rolling. Action. Thank you.